Hey guys, it's Katie and welcome back to another vlog. So I actually filmed what you're about to see a few days ago when I was back in my Atlanta house and I went and got my nails done. So there's like six minutes of vlog footage for that and it's just not long enough to make a full vlog. So I wanted to intro it, show you that footage and then I'll vlog for the rest of my day. Cut back to a few days ago. I'm gonna go get my nails and toes done for the first time in three months because of quarantine. Y'all, this is whack. I also look whack. I'm not back in my permanent house yet. This is still my overnight trip because it's now Wednesday at 11 a.m. So I like spent the night here but We're supposed to be coming back to this house permanently this weekend, which I'm really excited about I wanted to document this tiny little experience because it's something I want to be able to look back on on how I was literally trapped inside of my house Quarantining and self-isolating for three months and now finally my state is slowly reopening I've been getting a lot of hate about me social distancing and self-isolating I've literally been in my cabin with my family for weeks on end every two or three weeks I come back to my normal house and I see coal for a day and now my state is reopened if you don't know i live in georgia they opened restaurants salons gyms a lot of stuff like that and i'm still taking necessary precautions i have a face mask i've been wearing it when i go to the store we still use hand sanitizer like we're doing the best we can i also really miss my nail girl kate you guys know her so today i'm going to get my nails and my toes done and i'm so excited if you're just gonna hate on me for posting this video please don't watch it because it's my choice, but I'm literally wearing like pajamas right now, so I need to get a little changed. I'm leaving in around 20 minutes, but I thought I'd document this because it's like the first thing I'm actually getting to do going out into the world post quarantine. Obviously, we're still quarantined. We're self-isolating as much as we possibly can. I actually just got off the phone with my nail girl, Kate. I love her. She's like my favorite person ever. She's hilarious. I called and normally when I call, there's like a front desk manager who works the salon that answers my phone calls and they know who I am because I go there all the time and I have a big camera in my face. So I called and Kate answered and I was like, why would Kate answer? That doesn't make sense. And she was like, is this Katie? And I'm like, yeah. And she was like, I'm the only one in the store today. And I was like, what really because normally they have like 10 people working the salon i go to is giant she is the only person working and she has an appointment at 12 which is when i was gonna go so i'm gonna go at 12 30. that's crazy that's actually really good though she there's only one person working in the whole salon they're doing like only one appointment at a time so that's really good that makes me feel a little bit better because i was a little nervous i got changed and i'll show you guys my outfit really quick but i got two letters to my p.o box and i read them they're really sweet so chloe from texas sent me a second letter she actually sent me one before and i recognized her and then lupita from I think it's Wisconsin W I she sent me a letter so thank you to them I'm gonna show you guys where I put the letters and drawings and everything I have all of the stuff I've ever been sent fan drawings all of that all in here and I keep it in here I really need to get a bigger bin because this is just not cutting it anymore <laughs> but you guys know this is like my PR closet this is all stuff that I get sent this is filled with makeup and skincare and then this is just more stuff that's overflow that won't fit in there like Shelly Cove accidentally sent me two of all of these shirts and obviously I don't need to so I give these away to friends and family this random company sent me a lot of these rick and morty things and i don't watch them or watch the show i let friends and family rate it but let me show you my outfit should probably move the suitcase we won't be needing her for a while i am packed from the mountains because i had to bring all my clothes back because again we're like moving here permanently again but i'm still going back to the cabin today and then we, like i said we'll be coming back here this weekend permanently so i had to bring up a lot of my clothes so we can have space but here's my outfit this is just a thrifted shirt from the goodwill oversized tee I love it some pink Nike shorts and then I have my pink fluffy slides which these are from love culture I think that's what that store is called it's just chill and easy I have to wear shoes with open toes because I am getting my toes done and I'm so excited here's my mask that I'll be wearing these aren't for sale by the way I got lots of questions I custom made this myself it's not like a merch item although it does have my logo on it good morning Cole's awake <laughs> I have to be there at 12 30 so we'll leave in a little while it's one now and I'm finally getting my nails done through this glass screen <laughs> <laughs> Kate is on the other side. I guess the salon isn't open, so they only have her in here taking like individual appointments at a time. So I'm finally getting my nails done though, and I'm just gonna do acrylics with like springy colors. Not too long though, I wanna keep them kinda short. And then I need to get my toes done so badly. We're choosing the color now, the shape is all done, and it looks really pretty. <laughs> Look how many there is. Ooh yeah, I like that one, mm -hmm. that one's pretty. Okay, we're gonna do this yellow, this purple, this <laughs> green. And you picked another color. Oh. And orange, we need orange. I'm gonna do like five different colors on all my fingers. I'm so difficult, but I want spring nails, but I just did shorter than I normally get them You would think this is long, but this is way shorter for me, but I'm really excited 
and then I get to get my toesy woesies done. My nails are now done and they look so good. I'm gonna do a little close up, but I'm getting my toes done now. I'm surprised they make you put up this plastic even when you're getting your toes done. <laughs> I don't know. I, it's kind of I funny. Have no idea. It's just like, it's not like we're even close to each other, but <laughs> there's still a plastic thing. It's on all of them. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me show you my nails. They're so cute. I love them. Here they are. It's five different colors blue, yellow, purple, green, and then like this orangey pink. They're like springy. I love them. They look so good. And then we just did the opposite, like, colorway on this hand. And then I'm just gonna do white on my toes like I normally do. I'm basic. You have to say hi. All my followers Hello. miss you. They miss you. Yeah. Three months. <laughs> Three More months. Than two months. I know. It's been too long. <laughs> my nails and toes are now done, but my dad needed me to get a few things from Target next door. I need vanilla frosting. My brother needs vanilla frosting and food coloring for his last project of the year, which is like a really fun project. The only thing is I don't really see any food coloring. Even like the baking supplies are like out of stock. Look at this. That's crazy. I love my nails though, and I finished my toes. They're just white. I need to get out of here so I don't get sick. And now we're back. So I am back in my cabin. As you know, right now it is Saturday. And yes, I have a pimple patch on my face, okay? I have the same stubborn pimple that won't go away. Hasn't gone away for like two weeks. I'm back in my cabin now, as you can see. And we are actually leaving, like I said, permanently to go back to my Atlanta house tomorrow. And I'm very, very excited. But with that being said, I need to put together some of my things, round everything about. I'm gonna try and pack as much as I can today so tomorrow I can help my family with like cleaning and picking up what we need to. I said this before, but obviously we're gonna keep coming back to my cabin. It's just, we're not gonna be permanently here anymore. We quarantined here and self-isolated here for three months. But if you don't know, state of Georgia is open again. Literally like everything is reopened so I can see friends and family again. And then our boat is supposed to come here in like the next month. So it's just gonna be a really fun summer, hopefully. I don't wanna be disrespectful and like ignore COVID, but my state is opening back up and I get to go back to my normal house, which I'm so excited about. The rest of this vlog is gonna be me getting all my stuff to Together, packing up a little bit so we can return back to my house. I know you guys missed the yellow room content because so did I. <laughs> if you watched this vlog already, you know I took back a ton of my clothes. So this is literally the only clean clothes that I have here, which is just like a sweatshirt, some sweatpants, underwear, socks, that kind of stuff. I made a little pile of the few random things around my room that I need to take. I'm going to be taking my Katie's Corner blanket. By the way, all my merch this weekend is 10% off with the code 10 off. So go shop these blankets. You'll get 10% off. Everything is 10% off. I'll be taking this back. I'll have to take my yoga mat back. Here is my bag underneath here with a bunch of stuff that I need to take back as well. These bags are also 10% off on my merch shop. I love this tote bag, it's so good. I think I'm gonna start putting some stuff in this bag. Screw this tripod on. Whee! <laughs> the lighting might not be great, but I'm very sorry. Yeah, the lighting is not great. I can put you here. Is that better? <laughs> That's what it's gonna be. So I'm just gonna start filling this bag with a few things that I have already. I brought my Apple Pencil. I didn't use it up here because I've only had it for a few days. I have my wallet, my face mask, AirPods, external hard drive, mic for my camera. That's like all my little stuff that I can pack right now. Let's go to the bathroom. So you guys know we come up here all the time because this is our vacation home or cabin, whatever. So I do keep a lot of stuff up here. For instance, I keep all of my like bath products. I will be taking my razor because this is the only one I have, but I bought this face wash to stay here. All of these shampoos and conditioners stay here, so that's good. Oh, I need to take my I need to take my shower cap. I'm gonna be taking my pads and my tampons. <laughs> I bought these and I didn't end up using them because I haven't got my period yet. So these are fresh boxes and I'm gonna take them home with me. Let's go through these drawers. I have one scrunchie, I'll leave that here. Oh, my makeup bag, I need to take this with me. What's in here, what's in here? Oh, and nothing in there, okay. So I'm actually gonna leave these in here. I'm gonna leave these Q-tips and these cotton pads because I have some here, but I'll be taking these tonight once I'm done using them. Ooh, my necklaces. Definitely gonna need these. I love this chain. This has gotta be my favorite one that I got recently. What's down here? Oh, this is actually filled with hand sanitizer, but it's kind of empty, so I'll leave this. This Maui Babe stuff stinks. Like, I actually hate it. I used it once and hated the feeling, so I don't recommend it. I'll take my Nova Shine with me. This is my teeth whitener. I literally haven't used this in like four months. And melatonin, I'll leave that here. Those are pills to help you sleep. <laughs> oh, nail polish remover. But I can keep that here because I got my nails done. <laughs> Obviously, I have this ring light. 
but I'll be taking this home with me tomorrow. I'm gonna keep it here. I need to take on these acne patches. This toothbrush and this toothpaste can stay here. I will be taking my skin fridge home tomorrow, but again, it's plugged in, so I'm gonna leave it there. Let's transfer some things. The makeup bag is good to go. We can take this with us. I'm gonna put all my chains in here so they don't get all tangled up and lost. I just have this random plastic bag. Like, I know this is my house, but it feels like we've been on vacation here for three months because we literally have. These glasses I'm actually gonna leave here because I have a bunch of blue light glasses in my other house, so I don't need to take those. And I need all these skincare products. Let me put this in my bag. I have all my toiletries in here, but I'm gonna need these tonight and for tomorrow, so I will grab this in the morning. This has perfume, dry shampoo, deodorant, that kind of stuff. Progress, baby, progress. I really brought a lot of stuff home when I went to get my nails done this trip this week. So I don't have too, too much to bring, which is good. That was the point because we got to bring the rest of my family stuff too. I took my backpack home already. I took my suitcase home already. I only have this bag up here. So I'm going to need to take the rest of my clothes. Oh, I have some random stuff over here too. Okay, I can grab this. I guess I'll just have to put all my electronics and chargers and toiletries somewhere else because I don't have any more space. This is like a pack with me to go home vlog. <laughs> Hopefully you enjoyed this vlog and liked me getting my nails done. I really enjoyed having them. Had them for a few days by now and I've got lots of compliments. I hope everyone is staying safe happy and healthy. My school ends very soon, either the 21st of May or the 24th. I don't remember, but hopefully yours does too. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you in my next vlog. Wow, I haven't remembered to end a vlog in a while. Go me. Okay, bye guys. Love you.